Today was uh, post front, post spawn, was really tough today, and we still managed to boat 40 fish this afternoon. That's a better fish if I can keep him on. Cold water and late fronts push the spawn for bass here in the state into March. So now that April has rolled around, the bass are mostly spawned out and are now in a mode of rest and reload food-wise to regain weight losses due to protecting their nest 24-7 from intruders. There you go. We have had April fronts that just won't allow the water to warm as fast as we would like. So at the present, the fish are staged in groups, but are a little lethargic in movement, which means jigs, worms, and slow twitching baits like Stanley jigs or wedge spinners, slow rolling near the bottom work best. These baits mimic crawfish pushing mud along the bottom, which is what the bass want to feed on mostly to replenish energy. The key, when you find one bass, stick to the spot. Right now, schools are stacked up and are feeding together. Found a little cut, fish are deep, deep, and Doug just told me I've been fishing a spinner bait just a little bit fast, and I went down there and started dragging the grass real, real slow. First cast, boom. So one bite may in turn turn into five or six. So take your time, slower baits, and oh yeah, a day without a 20 mile an hour northerner would be great. John Jackson, Channel 2 Outdoors. Quick release.